Mr. Domestic channel for an Apple Weekly video this week. Um, if I actually speak louder, hopefully, in this video, let me know if that is actually good this time if I am speaking louder. But we're gonna get started right away. Um, we're gonna mainly we're gonna talk about iOS 70.1.2, iOS 70.2, and much more. There is or more. I don't know, it's not as much this week. But before we get started, someone has been asking me to shout them out. Give them a shout out. Um, I haven't ever shouted this person out before. His name is, um, this is his channel, Alex Left M. Um, he's one of my people from, uh, Gymnastics. Don't worry, that's not, he's not that rapper. He's a kid, friend, fine. So, subscribe to him. I'm just gonna type him up quickly on my Mac. If you mind me that. And I actually have the new wallpaper because I got it from like a video on YouTube. So I yield I was well, I actually got it from my iPad too. So it, it was just a uh, photo. So I'm just gonna get him on YouTube while I get him up there. So I was 70.2 beta four release this week with new changes and we'll get to those in a minute. I just want to search this guy up for you guys for a second. Alex. Alex. Mm -hmm. This is this guy. Mm -hmm. Don't know why it's not popping up for me, but it's weird. Let's see. Eh, it's not coming up for me, but Alex left M. Uh, maybe I need to put the L capital. Maybe that's why. Maybe that's why. Maybe I need to do that. Maybe not. I don't know. It's weird. Um, but this is his channel. Do search it up. Maybe on your device. Maybe it'll work a little, work a little better. Uh, but do search it up. Here it is. He doesn't really have much posted, but do search this up. Sorry about the delay, but uh, we're gonna get started now, for real. So I was seventy point two started, got started, and uh, this. Thank you. For talking about Alex, and there you go, Alex. You're welcome. Um, so I was seventy point one point two was released on Thursday, I believe, and I was seventy point two beta four was released on. Uh, Tuesday, and if we looked at how big the, the gigabytes were on the device, there were 275 megabytes for my Apple Watch, and we'll come back to that in a second. First, we're talking about uh, 70.2 beta 4, and it was 613 megabytes on my 14 Pro, and this is on my iPad Pro, third generation, iPad Pro 11 inch, third generation, 500 in 37.4 megabytes. And, oh, they've been working. I have no complaints except my Apple Watch over here. Um, there's one thing that I've been, I'm going to be, I've been complaining about. I just unlock it quickly because I'm not wearing it right now. Uh, there's one thing to complain about. In, in this, uh, this, whatever this app, this is, this is like Play More, recently played or something. This app, it's like the pl recently played and stuff. This app, whatever this is, and um, it just keeps going into it when I'm not even. It, it always went into audio when I'm playing audio throughout my phone, but now it just seems to be doing it randomly. Like when I'm not even playing audio, it randomly goes into this app, and I'm trying to always get out of it. Sometimes even like. Sometimes even tries gets gets glitchy every time I close this app. Sometimes or it opens it back up or it does weird things with that app. So there is bugs going around that. Um, but I don't really know what's happening with the this app, which which one. So yep. Um, it seems I don't know why it's doing that, but uh, I don't know. But now we're gonna get to so. I was having, now we're going to talk about a little about iOS 70.1, point point two, and then we're going to go back to iOS 70.2 since I didn't show you this. I was only able to get in this on iOS 70.1.2 on an iPad. Sorry about that, but 
Uh, this is iPad 6 generation. Uh, it's up, it's a, this update provides important security fixes, fixes and recommended for all users. And if we go to Apple's thing, don't know where I can find that. I'm just going to go to settings. Here on our 7.2. And I'm just going to go to... Well, I'm going to go to about uh, version of OS. And we're going to actually... Um, I don't even know where to go for this, but I'm going to go to Apple. OS. Uh, hold on, that doesn't seem to be right where to go, but I'll, there is a place to go for uh, iOS. I'll come back to you next week so I can uh, show you guys that, but unfortunately I don't have it right here on this iPad right now. Uh, but um, I'll get it next week. Uh, speaking of it, I'm, next week I'm not totally sure if I'll be doing a weekly uh, just to talk about that. Because uh, I have my first meet for the season for gymnastics next week. Uh, so that'll be starting next week in this channel, like last year. And if we just go to iOS uh, 17, the build for this is 21C5054B. So, um, so we are getting the beta 5. Um, I'm just gonna, uh, one second, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna search. Let's see what this means. Um, uh, it's weird. Um, but I'm, I was just searching up what the B means at the end of the sentence, but, uh, hmm. So if you have a 15A, there's like 15th major release of iOS 0. Yeah. Hmm. It's weird. Um, but I'll learn more about that next week, maybe, or get more. But, um, we're going to pick up the pace here, because it is seven minutes into the video already. Um, but this is the build number for this. And we are, and I noticed something different. So right here, where it says Apple Care and Warranty, it changed it. Now it added, like, Apple Care and Warranty. Like, it used to be just, like, Apple Care. Now it just says, now it says Apple Care and Warranty. And now if we go to like notifications, no sounds, there is now this new thing called the Volt Alerts. And we've been playing these for a while. And you can choose the default for all your third party apps. What what the sound is for them. And you also can do this on an iPhone, I'm just videoing with that, so it's hard kind of hard for me to show that. And um yeah. So Tim was able to get um we're talking about this in general. Um, we're talking about this stuff. I think I so. This is the amount of cycles on my iPhone 14 Pro. It is 360 cycles on my 14 Pro. And if we go to somewhere else, don't know where it is. It may not be here, maybe somewhere else. I forgot to take to somewhere. So, this is my iPad Pro's cycle count, it is 226. It's kind of crazy because this iPad Pro is two years old now. My phone's not even a year old yet, so it's kind of crazy to put those two and two together, and that's crazy. <laughs> so I'm just going to go back to my Apple, and you know, it's just kind of crazy um, that I have 360 cycles in my 15, you know, 14 Pro, but you know, I don't know. My Apple, this is, it's still on 90, just by the way, I took this photo on. Thursday, so I may not, maybe get adding like three to four more cycles onto it. Um, but I do want to ask you, say congratulations, guys, because I noticed that more people are watching my channel this week, or no, this, this month. Congratulations, guys. Thank you guys so much. Look at this. M most of November. Thank you guys so much. Um, so that's that. Um, so I just want to talk about our suit. iPhone, iOS 6, iPhone 16, iPhone 16, 16 plus the rumors so far, same 6.1 and 6.7 sizes, 60 hertz display, 
normal uh, action button. We are expected to get action button across the board next year. New capture button, whatever that is. A17 or A18 chip. Probably A17 since we, the way we've been going for the last year. And vertical camera layout like the iPhone 12s. Going back to the exclusive on device AI features. Will you guys upgrade? That is a question. This is what it looks like. I really don't like the camera setup right there, but I don't really like the way they put this flash. Um, so yeah, that's what, that's what I got for iPhone 16. Um, so what else should I talk about here? This is the capture one we're looking at. Uh, I don't even know what this is supposed to be. It looks like the antenna, 5G antenna line. I'm not really sure what that is supposed to be, but like this here. I don't know. So, let's see, is it there too? Yeah, I didn't do anything for that. Uh, yeah. So, now that I have phone, now I'm just gonna go to weather and show you guys a new, uh, those new icons. Like, we have new icons for, um, iOS 17, like iOS 17, beta 4, iOS 17. And here it is. I took, did this right before this. So, this, you got that. And then that's I'm just showing you that. And you got that. Though it's also on standby. That's why I'm showing you this. Oops, I went the wrong way. Sorry. And then it shows you the days of the week too. For uh widget and standby. And that's it for that. Um but it is also available in weather widgets here. If I show you uh, bring up the weather. Uh ch -ch -ch. you have this. We also have this. Which is new, I believe. And we have that one I use all the time. This one. This is one of them in the standby feature. We have this one in standby feature. And this is new too. I may start using this myself. Um, I'm going to edit just so I can show you guys. And I may start using it myself. Um, of course, I move my stuff around every time I do that. But, um, yeah. So. So, this is what it looks like. I think it looks pretty good. Uh, it tells you when the sun's down and sun's up. So, it fits right, right next to it, right next to my weather widget. So, it looks nice. Um, so, Hyper Pro, everything has been working good with beta 2. I was saying point 0.1, point 0.2. I think it's good. I really don't. I've only patched two bug fixes, bug fixes, which, um, which is good, but. Um, I think Apple forgot about the security response updates. Remember this security response? Um, Apple's security response and system files. I think they forgot about that a little bit. Because they should have, uh, did A and B security response. One A, one B for this. They should, kind of should have done that. But maybe there's a reason behind it. The reason could have been that it could have been, it needed more gigabytes or megabytes for that and wasn't able to do it uh for whatever reason but you never know i don't really know why apple did that but there's probably a reason behind it that it's not sharing there's only like two bugs they fixed uh but we're gonna end it here i think or somewhat here i don't really know but all right hope you guys like my background here I don't, I don't even need to get a new MacBook for this, but I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Shout out to Alex, Ian, or Alex, Lamb, whatever his name is in here. Uh, shout out to this guy, my friend Gymnastics. Thank you guys so much for watching. I was 70.2, now it's beta, beta 4 is out, and I'm just going to show you before we end this video. I'm just going to show you what's coming up next, what Apple's planning probably. So, now it's make or break. We can either see iOS 17.2 beta 5 or the RC at this point, which only time could tell. I do not know. Uh, but I cannot find my, uh, my uh, thing. Calendar, I'm just going to search it up. Um, cal calendar. So. I really don't have anything going on here. I hope you bought something about the Apple event last week. So, 
this week, if we see iOS 7.2 beta 5, we would see it on Tuesday. And if we saw iOS 7.2 RC, we would also see it on Tuesday. And that means we have iOS 7.2 RC this week, or we'll the final release on Monday of the next week. But if we see iOS 7.2, um, iOS 7.2 beta 5 on front on the fifth of December. So we could see iOS 17, iOS 17 RC in the following week on the 18th, see the final release. Or how can we just skip this whole week, skip this whole week entirely, and then pushing everything back? So it's a lot of scenarios we can see here for the next coming weeks in here. And we have Christmas all the way down here, so we're getting there. So, and this week I'm pretty sure Apple doesn't do anything, because uh, it's that week. There's only two weeks in the year that Apple doesn't do anything. It's like uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas. So that's when Apple doesn't do anything. But keep the lookout. Keep on the lookout for Tuesday this week for Beta 5, for 70.2 Beta 5, or an RC. Keep on the lookout, or you may not even see anything. All right, guys, let me know what iOS you're on, Betas. Are you on iOS 70.2 Beta 4 or iOS 70.1.2? Let me know in the comments below. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe. Like I normally edit like this video. I'll see you guys. Comment, like, and subscribe.